What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Bubba John 25. Today, I'm going to do my AEW Dynamite Pro review and results. You guys can do hit that red button, hit hit that like button, and let's get started. AEW was a good show because I felt the presence of the crowd of the AEW was electrifying. So, I enjoy AEW. So, without further ado, let me read you what, about what happened on, at AEW because this was a good show. This episode of AEW will be in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania at the Lord at the Litras Center. This the show begins at 8 p.m. East Time Central. Below you will find the card as well as the results rating for each match. Here are the AEW Dynamite match card for October 16, 2019. The Lucha Brothers versus Jurassic Express World Tag Team Champions Tournament first round. The SCU versus Best Friends for the World Tag Team Champions Tournament first round. Ryu versus Britt Baker, DMB, AEW Women's Championship match. And then we got Kenny Omega and Hangman Page versus John Moxley and Pac. And then Chris Jericho versus Dabari Allen for the AEW World Championship. All right, let me read. Now that now that's where the match card was at. The S the SCU versus Best Friends. Um. This match was good. I gotta say, this match was good. Right when the open opening title comes to the close, we are brought to some intense actions. As as C SCU is ambushed by the Lucha Brothers, a tag team set to have a match later on tonight. Christopher Daniels is injured after a power driver on the ramp, forcing Scorpio Sky. One of the three members of the SCU to sub in for Daniels. For Daniels. Then, um, since since that tag match tag match in the private party last week, I I am infinitely excited for the rest of this tournament. The of this tag teams can put on half a good as a match as the Young Bucks and private party. This tag team. Tournament tournament will be the reason to watch AEW Dynamite. The best friends put on a part on a pretty dominant performance, taking advantage of Kazarian's figure state. The suplex and spear spots were really great. Was the really get the crowd going? Once Scorpio Sky got tagged, the tie changed in a favor of SCU. The crowd is obviously in favor of Scorpio Sky at this point. Channing, he got no shoes. Since he is wrestling in skinny jeans, well, no shoes. Um, but it looks like it looks like as it as it looks like as if best friends may get the win with a knee from the top rope, but unfortunately of them they couldn't get the pin to finish the fin the finish from the SCU was a bit underwhelming, but they came out victorious. All right, it doesn't feel. I'm sorry, it does feel like AEW is is building up this team to be pretty dominant force, being able to get the win after being attacked by the Lucha Bros. And on uh, is no small, no no small feat. Um, I'm not sure. They will win the tournament, but the Scorpio Sky they couldn't make it up, make it all the way to the end of the tournament. The winners SCU, A SCU. This match was good. All right, let me move on. Santana Ortiz versus Random People Tr Trunks Tag Team. All right, this was a way in spotlight. Santana and Ortiz, two members. From the Jericho inner circle. Honestly, this was the first time I was kind of bored doing an AEW Dynamite show. It wasn't bad by any means, but squash matches are never all that fun. I'd rather see them do something with one of the many awesome tag teams AEW has, which may be impossible since they are all in the tag team tournament. We will see this team truly in action against the Young Bucks next next month. But until then, hopefully they can bring some hype for 
this team with some of the tag teams, and they got eliminated from the tournament. The winners of the match, Santana and Ortiz. Okay, Ryu versus Britt Breaker versus Ryu versus Britt Breaker. Britt Breaker looks so good. She looks gorgeous. D D M D A E W Women's Championship match. These are the two reasons I like this match from getting from the go. Britt Baker and Ryu are great, and I want to see these two put on an awesome match. I love this belt; it's being defended all the time. There was some, there was some about title matches. Every week, it just feels right. It feels, it feels like every match important as all, also crazy but unpredictable as I would have never guessed. Ryu will be in a, will be in an. Anger and a girl, AEW Women's Champion. But after you watch her, it all makes sense. She is amazing. She is amazing. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna lie. Ryu and Baker definitely slow down the pace from the first tag match with more debater strikes, deliberate strikes, and submissions. If you're the only star following AEW since Dynamite premiere then you will probably expect Ryu to win. Being able to defeat Nia Rose at such a rate, that was disadvantage. Surely Ryu can't conquer anything. Honestly, I thought Baker had this one. Once she almost had her signature submission set, I thought Baker was going to be crowned women's champion. However, Ryu managed to get the reversal for the surprise pin and then and retain the title. And that was it. The winner of the match and still your AEW Women's Champion, um, Ryu. Okay. The Lucha Brothers versus Jurassic Express for the World Tag Team Champions Tournament First Round. This match was this match was phenomenal. Um, Lucha, I love Jurassic Express, but Lucha Bros are definitely the favorite here. When, with that being said, the Young Bucks lost their lost to the private party, so I feel like anything can happen. Jurassic Express also seems to be a disadvantage without Luchasaurus, so, so I don't really I I, re, I don't really see them coming out of this win. Um, continue, and then I eat my words with a massive DDT from. Marco Stunt and Jungle Boy. Just when you thought Jurassic Express could actually stand toe to toe with such a dominant tag team, the Lucha Brothers just start be beating up this kid, and it's wild. But no matter how many giant hits Stunt takes, he managed to get up again. The end. The end of. In the end, Lucha Brothers were just too much for Marco Stunt and Jungle. Jack Perry, Lucha Brothers gets the win, advance to the next, the next round of the World Tag Team Tournament. The winner of the match, the Lucha Brothers. All right, um, Kenny Omega and Heyman Page versus John Moxley and Pac. This was a brutal match. I ain't gonna lie. Kenny Omega is may is maybe the best pro wrestler in the world. He's certainly in the top five. I think it's safe to say that beating. Kenny Omega means a big push for whoever gets that pin. In in this case, John Mossy is looking forward to pin a push, to pin and push. Um, side note: I never thought I would see Neville and Dean Ambrose fight Kenny Omega and Hangman Page. This is definitely wild time. Um, Kenny Omega wastes no time to get this match started. Honestly, I. I usually write as the match happens, but I couldn't really help but stop watching. It was just such an aggressive match that did not waste your time. I think this is the best. I think it was the best Masi has been in AEW Dynamite so far. And at any time, Omega and Pac entered entered the match. Speed is basically turned to eleven. I said it before and I'll say it again. This is the crowd that really makes these matches great. The crowd in Philadelphia tonight was so into this match. And, and it's awesome. Thank you, audience. 
you're the real MVP. The winner of the match, Kenny Omega and Hangman and Hangman Page. All right. Darby, Darby Allen versus Chris Jericho for the AEW World Championship match. This match was just this match I love to watch. This is the match I love to watch. Not gonna lie, Darby Allen riding a skateboard down the ramp put me in his corner. But then I remember Chris Jericho is on the other side. I didn't even know what to expect from this match. Chris Jericho is one of the greatest wrestlers of all time. Derby Allen is basically a mascot. Mascot hits. This is an os and also a street fight, which means just about anything goes. Okay. Um, I think this. I think the match is. The, I think the match type definitely has Allen in favor. The dude loves pain and can take a good bump or two. But like I said. Jericho is one of the best, best around. This has the end with Chris Jericho winning. If it doesn't consider me shook, even with Allen being significant, significantly faster than the pain, pain maker, uh, Chris Jericho can still keep up with this young, with the with the young star. Things started to get a bit bloody with a candlestick and a chair. Which wasn't out of the ordinary, especially in a street fight. It started to get really interesting when Jericho taped Allen, Allen's hand, hand behind his back. Well, you would think this would put Allen in a disadvantage, but he somehow managed to pull pull off some wild moves and almost pinned. However, as suspected, Jericho wins, but but the help but with the help of Jack Haggard winner of the match and your and still your AEW World Heavyweight Champion Chris Jericho again i feel like we are still at the beginning of something completely new i want to see if i'm exhausted enter enter lustic about AEW Dynamite in two months, but right now this show is is still great. I thought Santana and Ortiz squash match was a low point, and maybe the lowest point in AEW Dynamite short history. But if that is the lowest point, there is there isn't much to complain about. My match of the night has to be the the Omega and. Adam Hangman Page versus Moxley and Pot. This was the match of the night. I was getting New Japan vibes with the, with with the quick and aggressive nature of that match. Also, I mentioned before I love the AEW. Is spotting, is spotlighting is more unknown wrestlers like the Jurassic Express, Darby Allen, and Ryu. This could easily have been. The Cody Rose show and people will be fine with that, but it's not. And I think it's better for it. Not that Cody isn't amazing, but there is so much talent on this roster. I'm glad they are showcasing that as much as they can. So my my thoughts about AEW Dynamite, this this show was good. This this show was good. I really enjoyed it. I really enjoy AEW. I love watching AEW Dynamite. This show was awesome. So, like I said before, AEW is a good show. I love this match. I love I love the match card of the of the AEW tonight. I love the I love um, SCU versus Best Friends World Tag Team Champions Tournament first round. I love this match. Then I also love. Hold on, Santana and Ortiz versus Random People Trunks Tag Team. This match was good too. Ryu versus Britt Baker. Britt Baker looks so gorgeous. She looks gorgeous. Now this this match was oh, this match is I like. I I like to Ryu versus Britt Baker for the AEW Women's Champion. This match was very good. This this was the match of the night. And uh, Lucha Lucha Brothers versus Jurassic Express. 
World Tag Team Champions Tournament round, Tournament first round. This match was pretty. This match was pretty good. I ain't gonna lie. Kenny Omega and Hangman Page versus John Moxley and Pop. This was the match of the night. And also we get Durbin, Darby Allen versus Chris Jericho in an AEW in AEW World Championship match. This match was good too. But you already know Chris Jericho retains the retains the AEW World Heavyweight Champion. So anyway, if you guys enjoy my um, AEW Dynamite full review and results, give me a thumbs up. Comment down below what you guys think of AEW Dynamite, and I will see you guys tomorrow for my NXT review and results. Talk to you guys later, and I'm out of here.